hello welcome to red ted art today we're going to do this super simple very very easy pusheen uh, rock pet or cat rock friend and um, they're so easy to do and to be honest almost not a craft but you know they're so cute and they're really nice to give to your friends so what you'll need is is to collect some stones different colors are fine um, i think the darker ones look nice too and they contrast the heart really nicely but the lighter ones um, are really good because obviously you can then see the black pen so i'm going to do one of these um, which basically means you have the little pusheen ears, like so. Then you've got two little eyes. A little cute nose, some whiskers. And then I'm going to do the little paws for holding the heart or whatever it is your pusheen is holding. I'm actually going to have a go to donut. I do quite like the hearts. Now I'm using something called enamels. I'm going to put them below. And the, the description of what these are but you can also use nail varnish which is why these are out and if you are using nail varnish you might want to use a toothpick to help um, you know spread the paint because then you can get it a little bit more accurate and paint the varnish but I think these would look really good with nail varnish so for the donuts I'm just going to literally draw a little circle from one paw to the other I might have to go put a tiny bit of black on there because um I went into its paw a little bit too much that's okay, once it's dry, I'll just add a little bit, like so, like this, this is quite a fine pen. Now I'm going to let this dry, and then once it's dry, I'm going to go over with a second colour and put some little dots on, um, like a little, um, you know, donut with little sort of berries on it. And then just because we've got the time, why not, I'm going to do another pushing like this one where you put the little ears at the top here because the stone's got that sort of shape. I'm also going to go across and do some little hairs, little eye, whiskers, and then I'm going to get the cat coming all the way around with some little details on the back and all the way around here. You can add a tail if you want or not. On this one I did. I think on this one I won't. I'll just keep it simple. There you go. And then again, if you want to, you can add a little heart. I might give this one, let's see, a little yellow heart, because I've got the yellow out. Why not? Put a little, this one, I'm going to put the, the heart here. And I think these make really, really sweet um, pocket friends. So you can make them, give them to your friends, and, um, you know, they're just a quite a nice little thing to have on your desk or in your pocket. Now, did you see my finger? I hurt myself in the garden. Can you believe it? Really bad cut. So you're going to see my finger in a plaster for quite some time over the coming weeks. Anyway, this is it for today. Hope you liked our little pushing craft. I know it's really simple, but sometimes the simple crafts are the loveliest. And uh, see you here on Red Art again soon. Bye. Actually, this video isn't over yet. Ha <laughs> ha, sorry. I totally forgot. I need to still add some little bits of purple to my donut. Tiny, tiniest bit. You don't need a lot. I wanted to put some little, uh, like, these like little donut sprinkles, aren't they? Like so. And then I also decided, actually, that on this little pusheen kitty, I wanted to put a tail, like so. And I also wanted to put little feet. I mean, you basically just make it up as you go along. And because stones are so easy to find, you know, there's no real rule whether you have to do it one way or another. And this one, I also wanted to give little pink cheeks. It's not strictly speaking necessary, but what I'm saying is experiment, see what you want to do. Anyway, so these are our little super duper easy pushing pet friends. And don't forget to subscribe and see you here on Red Head Out again soon. Oh, oh, sorry, I keep forgetting. Have you seen these? This is one of the bowls we did earlier this week, made from shredded paper, aren't they cool? Anyway, look in the links below or check the, ch uh, you know, the, the channel homepage and you'll see how to make those too. Anyway, see you again soon. Don't forget, Mondays and Fridays, lots of kids crafts. Bye!